Hello everyone, welcome to my presentation. I am Sangeeta from Sri Venkateshwara College of Engineering, Bangalore from the Department of Computer Science and Engineering. Today we are going to discuss about engineering mathematics. And today's topic is binomial distribution. Before going to the topic, let's go with introduction to probability distribution. A probability distribution is a mathematical function or rule that describes the likelihood of different outcomes or events in a particular scenario or experiment. It defines all possible values a random variable can take and the probability associated with each value. It provides a way to model and understand the uncertainty or randomness inherent in a situation by assigning probabilities to different outcomes. Probability distributions are fundamental in statistics allowing us to analyze data, make predictions and draw conclusions based on the likelihood of various events occurring. Binomial distribution. The binomial distribution is a probability distribution that describes the number of successes in a fixed number of independent trials, where each trial results in a binary outcome, either success or failure, with a constant probability of success. The best example for binomial distribution is a tossing of coin, where you will be getting only two outcomes, either head or tail, like success or failure. We will be getting only two outcomes. So, this type of probability distribution is known as binomial distribution. Basics of binomial distribution. Fixed number of trials. The number of experiments or trials is predetermined and remains constant throughout. Independent trials. Each trial is independent of the others, meaning the outcome of one trial does not affect the outcome of the other. The meaning of independent trial is if the first trial will be getting head and the second trial will be getting tail, there is no effect in getting the different outcomes in each trial. Binary outcome. Each trial has only two possible outcomes, typically labeled as success, usually denoted by P and failure denoted by Q, where Q is 1 minus Q because uh, the sum of success and failure is equal to 1. P plus Q is equal to 1. Constant probability of success. The probability of success P remains constant for each the probability mass function of the binomial distribution gives the probability of obtaining exactly k successes in n trials. P of x is equal to k is equal to n c k into p to the power k into 1 minus p to the power n minus k where k is of getting successes and P of x is equal to k is the probability of getting uh, success and NCK is combination where NCK can be written as N factorial divided by K factorial into N minus K factorial where P is the probability of getting success in each trial and 1 minus P is the probability of getting failure in each trial. The binomial distribution is commonly applied in various fields such as statistics, biology, economics and more where events can be categorized into binary outcomes and the focus is on counting the number of successes in a fixed number of trials. Probability mass function. The probability mass function, PMF, is a function that provides the probability that a discrete random variable x takes on a specific value x. It is denoted as P of x is equal to x or f of x. For the binomial distribution, the PMF, the probability mass function gives the probability of obtaining exactly k successes in n trial. Here the k variable is used for successes. As we know p of x is equal to k is the probability of getting success. Nck is a combination and p of k where p is the probability of getting success in each trial. 1 minus p can also be written it as q where q is the probability of getting failure in each trial. Next is cumulative distribution function, CDF. The cumulative distribution function gives the probability that a random variable x takes on a value less than or equal to a specific value x. It is denoted as f of x. For the binomial distribution, the CDF calculates the probability of getting up to k successes in n trials. 
f of k is equal to p of x less than or equal to k which is equal to summation of i is equal to 0 to k n c i into p of i into 1 minus q to the power n minus i. Here f of k is cumulative distribution function and where n c i is also a combination function and here p is getting success in each trial and 1 minus p is getting failure in each trial. Properties and characteristics. Mean and variance. The mean, expected value and variance of the binomial distributions are given by where mean mu is equal to n into p, variance is equal to mu uh, sigma square which is equal to n into p into 1 minus p and standard deviation is equal to root of variance where the standard uh, where standard deviation of binomial distribution is root under n p q or root under n p into 1 minus p. Shape and symmetry. The shape of the binomial distribution can vary based on the values of n and n. Where p is close to 0 0.5 and n is moderately large, the distribution tends to be symmetric and bell shaped, resembling the normal distribution. Approximation to normal distribution. For large values of n, the binomial distribution can be approximated by the normal distribution using the central limit theorem, especially when n p and n into 1 minus p are both greater than 5. Applications Where all the binomial distributions are used widely in various fields, including quality control, biology, economics, and more, where events can be classified into binary outcomes and the focus is on. Counting the number of successes in a fixed number of trials. Applications of binomial distributions. Quality control and manufacturing. Accessing the quality of a product by examining a sample for defective items. For instance, checking a batch of manufactured goods for defective units. Biological studies. Analyzing genetic triads such as probability of inheriting a particular gene from a parent in offspring. Business and finance. Estimating the probability of success or failure in investments, predicting the success rate of marketing campaigns or analyzing the likelihood of meeting sales targets. Medical trials and drug testing. And determining the success rate of new drug in curing a disease based on the number of patients who respond positively to the treatment. Sociological studies. Investigating social behavior or attitudes by conducting surveys where responses are categorized as yes or no. Sports analytics. Predicting match outcomes in sports where there are two possible outcomes, win or lose, based on historical data and team performance. The main applications of binomial distributions is where we will be getting possible outcomes as only two outcomes, either true or false. For example, win or lose in sports and X or no in attitudes or in other surveys and head or tail in tossing of coin. So these are the best applications of binomial distributions. Assumptions and limitations. Assumption of binomial distribution. Fixed number of trials. The distribution assumes a fixed number of independent trials which might not always be the case in practical situations. Independent trials. It assumes that each trial is independent of the others meaning the outcome of one trial does not affect the outcome of the other trial. In reality, this independence might not hold true in certain scenario. Binary outcomes. The distribution assumes only two possible outcomes, success or failure for each trial, which might oversimplify situations where multiple outcomes exist or where the outcomes are not strictly binary. Constant probability of success. It assumes a constant probability of success P for each trial, which might not always remain consistent in real life situations. They are independent trials. This independence might not hold true. For example, if one team has won the match, it, it is not independent. It is dependent on another uh, uh, group where it is lost the match. So, always the trials will not be dependent. 
limitations of binomial distributions not suitable for continuous data the binomial distribution is specifically designed for discrete data with a fixed number of trials making it unsuitable for scenarios involving continuous variables large sample size requirements when the number of trials n is small or the probability of success p is close to 0 or 1 the binomial distribution might not approximate well to the normal distribution affecting its accuracy limited scope of applications it might not be the best model for situations where the assumptions are violated or where outcomes are influenced by complex factors beyond a binary choice. Sensitivity to parameter values. The distribution can be sensitive to variations in the number of trials and the probability of success, potentially impacting the reliability of predictions or estimations. Conclusion. Conclusion about binomial distribution. The binomial distribution stands as a valuable probabilistic model that offers insights into scenarios with fixed trials and binary outcomes. Its simplicity and applicability across various fields make it a foundational concept in probability theory and statistical analysis. However, acknowledging its assumptions and limitations is crucial for accurate modeling and Interpretation. Interpretation and application. Interpreting results from the binomial distribution requires a careful assessment of the context and how well the assumptions align with the observed data. Additionally, considering alternative distributions or approaches is essential when the binomial assumptions are not met. Decision making and risk assessment. While the binomial distribution aids in decision making by quantifying probabilities, its limitation highlights the importance of critical analysis and possibly exploring other models to account for more complex or varied scenarios. In summary, the binomial distribution offers a robust framework for analyzing discrete outcomes in a fixed number of trials. If its effective application necessity a balanced consideration of its assumptions, limitations and the context of the scenario under examination. Thank you.